Hi everyone, this is Kevin with Kintone Customer Success, and in this video, we're going to check out how to import data sheets. Let's say, for example, that I want to import this column of data into my app. Here's a step-by-step -step look on how to do it. First, click on the ellipses icon on the right. Select Import from File. Click Browse, and select your file. Select this option if your first row is a header, and this option if your first row is data. Selecting an option will open the preview section, displaying the first five rows of data. Under Column and File, select the column from the imported file that matches the fields in the app. For each column on the left, use the dropdown to select a column, or select None to not import data into that field. But since we want to update existing records in the app with the imported data, we'll select key to bulk update on the right to use the record number as the key identifier. Text, number, date, date and time, and the link fields can also be used as keys. To use a field other than the record number as the key field, the field in the app settings must be set to prohibit duplicate values. When you're ready, click import and OK. The top of the page shows a message stating either the file import was successful or unsuccessful. As you can see, it was successful. And if a large number of records were accidentally created, you can delete the records in bulk through the bulk delete function. And that's how you use the import from Excel CSV function. Thanks for watching.